This is part two of 1.1, inductive and deductive reasoning. We just have one more example that I wanted to go over with you all in case you need some help with it. So using reasoning with deduction, we're going to solve a logic puzzle. Now this particular logic puzzle will give you some clues and using those clues, we're gonna to try to figure out which of these four students were elected as the new class officers. So let's go ahead and read through this real quick. It says, Brianna, Ryan, Tyler, and Ashley were recently elected as the new class officers, president, vice president, secretary, and treasurer for the junior class at Parkland High School. I wonder if those kids really are there. From the following clues, determine which position each of them holds. So we have these, these three clues. And what I did here on the bottom is I made a chart. So if you look at your textbook and you read through some of the examples you're going to see something similar to this okay and what i'm going to do in my preference because they, they i believe they use x1s or something like that um but personally i just like to use x's and check marks so just so we kind of have a little legend here a check mark will mean yes and an X will mean no. This is just my personal preference, but you can use dots and squares or whatever, whatever you feel comfortable with. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and read the clues. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and fill out this chart to try to figure out who got what position. Okay, so the first clue says that Ashley is younger than the president, but older than the treasurer. So right away, that tells me that Ashley is not the president. So here's Ashley. She can't be the president because she's old, she's younger than them. And she can't be the treasurer because she is older than them. Okay. Second clue, Brianna and the secretary are both the same age and they are the younger members of the group. So according to clue number two, Brianna and the secretary, so that means Brianna is not the secretary. So her and whoever the secretary are, they're the exact same age. And they're also the younger members of the group, okay? Clue number three, Tyler and the secretary are next door neighbors. So again, Tyler and whoever the secretary is are related somehow as neighbors. So Tyler is not the secretary either, okay? So what this does is it narrows down the, the, um, the position that these four students might be. Now we're gonna to have to think a little bit further because these are the only clues we have. So we kind of we are gonna use our deductive reasoning based on this information to help us figure out at least one of them. And once we figure out one, we can kind of you know deduce who who the next one is and so forth. So here's how it works. I know that Ashley is younger than the president and older than the treasurer. So she's older than at least one person. Okay. So let's look at clue number two. Let's keep that in our head though. Brianna and the secretary are both the same age. So let's look at the secretary for a moment. The secretary is either going to be Ryan or it's going to be Ashley, okay? Just let's keep that in mind. Let me erase that just so you see what we're talking about. If the secretary is Ashley, so if this were the tentative, I'm gonna put little quotes here. If this were a yes, okay? That means that Ashley and Brianna are the youngest ones in the group, because it says they're the younger members of the group. And that also means that number one, clue number one wouldn't be valid because here it says that Ashley is younger, but she's older than the treasurer. So if Brianna and Ashley are the same age, that means they can't be, and they're the youngest ones, that means that they cannot be older than anybody, which means that Ashley is not the secretary. Let me repeat that just in case you missed that. So since Ash, if Ashley were the secretary, she would be one of the youngest ones in the group because according to clue number two, Ashley or Brianna and the secretary are the youngest ones, okay? Which means they can't be older than anybody else and they're also the same age. So because of that, Ashley is not the secretary, which means that, I should have done that in yellow, sorry. Which means that the only option for secretary is going to be Ryan. So Ryan is the secretary, we're done with him. 
If Ryan is the secretary, that means that Ryan cannot be the president, he cannot be the vice president, and he cannot be the treasurer. Okay. All right, moving on. So what else, what other information do we have? We have that Ashley is younger than the president and older than the treasurer. Let's see. Well, we really know that. Oh, actually, you know, we have something even better. So you see how I crossed out these X's here and we had this one check mark. Take a moment and look at our chart and see if you see anything like that here. So pause it if you need to. I'm going to give the answer in a bit. We should have spotted it right here. So we see that Ashley is not the president. She's not the secretary and she's not the treasurer. Therefore, she must be the vice president. So once the way these puzzles work is once you get one, you can kind of cross out, you know, the the ones across and the ones going up and down vertically. And that that gives more spots um, crossed out, which gives us less things to, to guess or think about. OK, so now that we know that Ashley is the vice president, we know that Tyler's not the vice president and Brianna is not the vice president either. OK. All right, let's move on. So now we just have to figure out Brianna and Tyler. I don't really know much about Tyler. All I know is that him and the secretary are next door neighbors, which doesn't really help us much um, because we don't care about where they live at this point. However, for Brianna, I do know that she is one of the youngest members of the group. So she's either going to be the president or the treasurer. Do we know anything about the president or the treasurer? Well. We know that Ashley is younger than the president and older than the treasurer. So let's look at this first clue. If Ashley is younger than the president, that means the president is older than Ashley, correct? So if the president is one of the older ones, that means that Brianna is not the president. Oh, wrong color. I'm trying to color code this nicely. So that means that Brianna is not the president, which means that the president must be Tyler. And Brianna is the treasurer. And just like that, we can cross out our last one. So with this information, we now know who everyone is. Brianna is our treasurer. Ryan is the secretary. Tyler is the president and Ashley is the vice president. And this is an example of using deductive reasoning for a logic puzzle.